Hello and welcome to the first in the series of UDK3 scripting training videos. This is an introduction to the UDK3 scripting system for absolute newbies. The assumptions in this series is that you know little to nothing about programming, that you realize that if you want to create a real game in the UDK3 environment, you are going to have to learn about programming. And C, specifically, you need to know how to program in the UDK3 scripting environment. Now, it's, I'm also assuming that you know your way around the UDK editor, that you don't have to be an expert at it, but you know your way around it, and you have tried um, some kismet. Not an expert at it, but at least you tried it. So, what we're going to do is is that we're going to go into lesson one real quick and here we are in lesson one and lesson one is really what you need to get started um, use sticky notes to keep notes that's what you see in here is sticky notes because we'll need to keep a lot of notes and here's where you get sticky notes and they're free no charge and then join google docs to upload all your notes and codes and this is where you go docs.google.com and again that's free. And the reason why we're going to do that is because there's so much that we need to keep track of in learning how to do UDK3 scripting that we need a resource somewhere on the cloud, on the internet, where we can easily access this stuff. Then three, get a good text editor like Notepad++. And that's where you get that. And again, it's free. And then lastly, Get a good file manager program, such as Explorer++, and here's where you get that, and that's free. These are the tools that we're going to use in order to learn uh, how to do scripting in the UDK3 language. Okay, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching.